Imagine our world without meaning. It would be like a world without soil. Fortunately, Ecology Action Director John Jevons knows how to grow soil. His grow biointensive small scale agriculture method yields a complete diet and grows soil up to 60 times faster than nature. Soil is a growing medium, and the quality makes a world of difference. Likewise, my business school mentor, Jane Lorand, she would say, Culture is a growing medium for change. What do you want to grow? Imagine meaning is the soil, the lifeblood of human culture. Meaning is what makes life worth living. Yet a United Nations Special Committee on Sustainable Development concluded meaninglessness is the single greatest problem facing societies worldwide. I surmise that like soil, meaning can be cultivated through enterprise and that meaning entrepreneurship is the emerging innovation arc for the business organization. Once we have re-engineered the way we make and deliver products and services and we no longer operate beyond the carrying capacity of our biosphere, then what? Sustainability alone cannot be the destination for global human culture. Yet, the sciences of sustainability, renewable energy, biomimicry, green chemistry, and so forth, certainly should build our roads to get there. Just as business can solve complex environmental challenge, business can grow vibrant human culture by connecting people to their purpose and to the purpose of the work, making meaning while making money. Purpose is one of the most powerful ways human beings create meaning. It is a raison d'etre, a kind of emotional nutrition that fills an invisible need of the heart. Unique to you, your purpose is like a North Star guiding you toward that which gives your life meaning. Simon Sinek, author Start With Why, describes how purpose directly correlates to business, innovation, influence, customer loyalty, and repeated success. This is because people guided by purpose are intrinsically motivated for the work. Sticks and carrots are expensive. Intrinsic motivation, that's priceless. Beyond making a product for a market need, companies can create a much larger trajectory, an invisible destination that inspires and galvanizes, ensures employee retention, and gives people more than just a job. Moreover, connecting people to their purpose optimizes health. National Geographic conducted research in communities around the world they call blue zones, places where people commonly live over 100 years of age. Purpose, their study concluded, is a core determinant promoting happiness, health, and longevity. Happier people are healthier. They experience less toxic stress, which is linked to stroke, heart disease, obesity, and early mortality. Creating purposeful work can reduce healthcare costs and increase human vitality, resulting in a positive net impact on human culture. Business grows culture by shaping the lives of the individuals who invest their time and consciousness into the work. No matter how much you pay an employee, you are still renting part of that person's finite life force energy. You can never pay a person enough to value the preciousness of life. You can give a person the gift of living into their purpose while working for you. And this is a transcending gesture beyond sustainability and a worthy destination for global human culture. I really like Idris Muti's idea 
Every company needs a chief meaning officer, bringing purpose to products and services, growing organizations that are more profitable, innovative, and happy places to work. Make meaning, make money. Let's grow the cultural soil of our future, giving everybody in all societies rich and meaningful lives. Thank you.